Gesualdo is an incredible character. He's a very modern person. He's by all means an extraordinary composer. He liked to compose extraordinary and bizarre music. And his music is deeply bizarre. And for us now, in the 21st century, profoundly interesting. Mm -hmm. The whole idea is to realize in an actual music drama that Gisualo's music is as contemporary as ever. One, two, three. Are you going out now before the wedding? Gesualdo was struck by, by madness. And the way madness strikes people is um, dramatic and revealing. I think our Gesualdo is a portrait of a man in evolution through his uh, three main crises, leading to a um, step of maturity that makes him die at the right moment so we can enjoy his legacy. As a libertist, I like to have several levels intertwined, not just one story. It's very common, people say, oh, just focus on the love story, just focus on. But I want all those levels mingled together. 